pretty groovy jumbo jet, eh? When you see this jet of rocket dough come a knocking, baby. Yeah! I'm gonna need you to sign these release forms. Release forms? Well, yes, you're not officially working for the Ministry of Defense, and these forms indemnify the Ministry against any um, mishaps that may occur in the line of duty. Mishaps? But isn't that what being an international man of mystery is all about? Okay, name. Austin Danger Powers. Sex? Yes, please. <laughs> How does a hot chick like you end up working at the Ministry of Defense? Oh, well, um, I went to Oxford, where I excelled in several subjects, but I ended up specializing in foreign languages. You know, I really wanted to travel. You know, sort of see the world. That's fascinating, Vanessa. Listen, why don't we go in the back and shag? What? I've been frozen for 30 years. I've got to see if my bits and pieces are still working. Excuse me. My wedding tackle. I'm sorry. I'm... My meat and two veg, my twig and berries. Hello, lad. Oh, just no, Mr. Powers, Hello, Mr. Lad. Powers, please. I'd appreciate it if you could concentrate on our mission and give your libido a rest. Can I, uh, can I show you something? If you're feeling sad and lonely, there's a service I can render. Tell the one who loves you only. I can be so warm and tender. I won't bite. Hard. Alright. Let me ask you a question and be honest. Ooh. Do I make you horny? Randy? Do I make you horny, baby? Yeah, do I? God, I hope this is part of the unfreezing process. Oh, turn it! Oh, look at that! Oh, turn it! Oh, I fell over! Oh, I fell over again! Oh, Mr. Powers! I will never have sex with you, ever. If you were the last man on Earth and I was the last woman on Earth, and the future of the human race depends on our having sex simply for procreation, I still would not have sex with you. What's your point, Vanessa? 